Hi, Draw So Cuties, Wendy here. Today we're gonna draw Masha from Masha and the Bear. So let's get started. To draw this cute girl, let's first start by drawing her eyes. So I'm gonna come right here and draw a big circle. And then come right across about right here and draw another circle. There, and then my two circles in. Let's make them draw so cute eyes with two small circles inside for highlights. And a curved line at the bottom. And shade in the top. And lines at the bottom. And same thing over here. There, now these eyes in, let's come to the top and we're going to draw a bunch of little lines for her lashes. There, and so same thing over here. I just like to draw the ends first so I know where to put everything else in. <laughs> there, and then let's give her a big sweet smile. So about right here, I'm gonna go ahead and just draw a big curve that goes all the way across and then cap it off. From there, let's go ahead and frame her face. So I'm gonna use the top of my eye and come out about right there. Same thing over here. And we're just gonna draw a big curve all the way around. So let's come down. And I'm gonna go around. So same thing here. Come down. I'm gonna go around. And so I'm just kind of imagining how low I want it. So I'll say about right here in the center, I'll give myself a point, just so I know where I'm going. So then from there, I'm gonna go ahead and draw a curve coming all the way down. And same thing here. So definitely turn your body or the paper. It makes it easier for you to draw this curve. There. Okay, so now bottom of the U in. Then let's go ahead, I'm gonna bring it up a tiny bit more. And then we need to draw her bangs. So right over her eyes. So I'm gonna say about right here, I'll start in the center and I'm just gonna give myself a little zigzag. And we're just gonna go all the way straight across and here and there, I'm gonna break it up. These little zigzags, but we're going all the way across. So sometimes a little bit bigger, zigzag, smaller. It's all up to you. But we just want to break it up so it's not just one straight line across. There. Okay, so now we have that in. Let's go ahead and we're going to continue this up. So she's wearing a headscarf, so her hair is all contained. So we're just going to go up. So just kind of see how high you want to bring her head and I'll say about right here. And then I'm gonna to start to come down on the other side and bring it down. There. Just extend these out a little bit more. And then from there, let's see, let's uh, come to the top. I'm gonna find my center. So I'm gonna go up and say about right here. I'm gonna give myself a point and this part right here, I'm just gonna round it off and then draw an angle coming down and tapering into her head. So same thing here, just so we can draw her head scarf. There, 
And then I'm going to come above this point, come up just a little bit more. And we're going to once again round off this tip and then come down. And go around. So same thing here. So it's a little bit thinner at the top and then it's going to come out and down. And I'm just going to bring it around. Okay, so before I finish that, let's go ahead. I'm going to come back to the center. We need to draw this bow. So, I mean, not a bow, but where she ties her um, handkerchief. So for her headscarf, so about right here, I'm going to go ahead and draw two lines and then connect it right there. And then the tail of her handkerchief, we're going to bring it out and tuck it right back in and draw a little line in the center. Same thing here and bring it in and a little line. Then from there, we can finally tuck in our head scarf. So we're just going to bring it in and just tuck it in. So same thing here. There, so cute, right? <laughs> Hopefully I'm helping you so far. Then from there, let's draw her cute little dress. So I'll say about right here and here. Just make it nice and even and we're going to bring down this little angle line. We're just going to come all the way down, getting wider as we come down. So it's a long dress. I'm just going to say about right here. And here. And then let's go ahead and connect it with a curve all the way across. Oops. There. Okay, so then now that we have that, let's draw her tiny feet. So about here, I'll pop in a foot or shoe. So curve it out and then just connect with a curve. And then for some detail, you can add a curve right here for a sole and then the top part of the shoe. So same thing here. Curve out and about right here, same thing. Connect and once again, curve and then another curve at the top. There. And for some details on her dress, let's come right here. Draw a curve and then another one going up. And then there's going to be a line right here to break it up. And another one right here for some details on the bottom of her dress. There. Okay, so then now let's draw her arms. And I thought it'd be cute to have her arms going out. So um, I'm going to put them in this area right here. So I'll say about right here. I'm going to go ahead and just draw this angle line. And another one about right there. Then I'll cut it off. And then let's draw the hands. So a thumb. Nice and simple, and we're just going to draw a big curve for the rest of her fingers to simplify it. And I'll just add two lines right there. So same thing on the other side, but right there. Let's bring it out to about right there. And once again, cut it off, and then the hands, the thumb and fingers and two lines there and then for some more details on her sleeves right here I believe there's a little more detail right here and here so I draw a line to cut that off and last but not least I need to add a heart somewhere right so I'll add it right here in the center of her dress to make her my draw so cute Masha from Masha and the Bear. I really hope I helped you draw her fun and easy today. And if I did, please make sure to give me a like and subscribe so you won't miss any new draw so cute videos. See you later.